imagine. Just got an image. That's the uh, leaf blower. And I thought to myself, okay, I want to meditate. This noise is on, so what do I do? Turn the noise into a form of meditation. And um, so suddenly, before I knew it, I closed my eyes and I was zooming along through the wind towards the person that was using it and then suddenly I became dust and that's how small I became and I was going through the ventilation of the of, of the thingy whatever it is and then getting smaller and smaller as I was zooming through to the point where it reached a singularity point where it couldn't get any smaller and then it inverted in on itself and suddenly I was on the other side and it was then coming out through basically what it would have been the other way around but now I'm getting bigger I'm suddenly coming out into a into another world that is physical in a sense and that world is on the other side of the singularity and that's how and that's how they got here through the other side of the singularity <laughs> and that's what some of the things that have been going on like CERN for instance that's what they're trying to do they're creating wormholes into other dimensions and it just so happened that they were also trying to do the same thing and there you go and it's like it's as if they're trying to say It's just another way of understanding. And so the best way is to kind of <coughs> go through my metaphors, through my own imagination, for what's happening right now in the very moment. So if I was so small that I, I was at the singularity and it went inside of itself, and out the other side was another world. Like another kind of communication. He also joked that he said, "You guys do like to dig your tunnels, don't you?" <laughs> As if they're they're able to they're able to determine what we've done to him. <laughs> There's like an implication there. It's like 
it's almost like you guys are just trying to get out and you've dug so many tunnels trying to get out that you've had to live, start living in them too you know it's like it's crazy and it was almost like all along it was it was just about trying to get out in a weird way and so everyone kept trying to get out but the tunnels they were digging weren't really the ones that needed to be made they couldn't be dug within matter Tunnels had to be dug through energy. Because the energy has like a memory of everywhere it's been. And so the energy can remember. The echo had to be loud enough and the only way that could happen was to repeat like a feedback loop until it got loud enough to be heard. 